Hello everybody, this is George Ponder for WPCentral.com. Got a uh, review for you today. It's a Windows 8 application. It's Photoshop Express. It's also available for Windows 8 RT. So it'll run on the Windows Surface, the, the Windows Surface, the Microsoft Surface RT tablets. It's a nice application, very basic. I, I'd be fibbing if I, I didn't say it was lacking with features, but it's a good start. First launch the application, you've got three choices where you can pull images from. Your pictures library, Adobe Revel, which is their uh, little cloud storage service, as well as launching your camera on your tablet or computer to capture an image to edit. Go ahead and take a look at pictures library. It's everything on your computer. You can search all your files, go into your SkyDrive if you've got a thumb drive attached, Wherever your pictures library will pull pictures from is where you can find pictures to edit. Take a look at uh, SkyDrive real quick. Pull up a picture to edit. And this is your basic editing. This is your, your start point with your editor. It's a fairly big file, so it's going to take a second. You can connect your Windows phone and import pictures there to edit. I took this with a Canon 6D, so it's a larger image. It's a full frame image. So it took a few seconds to load. But down below, here you go, you've got your crop tools. Take a look at that. You can freeform freehand crop your image. You also have a couple of presets. You can turn it into a 5x7. When you get everything set, just hit the back arrow and there's your cropped image. Your correct, correct tools cover contrast, exposure, and white balance. You've got sliders that can adjust the image. Over here you can view the difference between the before and the after. Uh, views of the image and then you can just simply reset it, wipe out all your changes and start from scratch. You've got looks which are effect filters, effects filters, boost contrast, you got vivid, uh, carmine, turn it into black and white, aquatic, I'm going to say 15 in total. Now you've got premium looks which is a premium add-on pack that you can purchase I believe it's running two dollars and ninety nine cents. That'll pull, push the filters up to I want to say thirty five. Nice selection of filters. I kind of like the Carmen because it gives it a little bit of a color, a little bit of a black and white mixture. When you get through with uh, the look that you like, hit back. You've also got a red eye tool that'll take out red eye, the uh, little red uh, reflections in your subject's eyes. You've got an auto fix that'll just pick the right settings and try to fix the picture automatically. And then you have a reduce noise tool. It's a noise reduction filter. So when you take the pictures at high, high ISOs, you get a little bit of a grainy effect to it. This is going to reduce that grainy effect. It's another add-on pack running $4.99. And just tinkering with a preview screen, it's a nice filter. When all is said and done, you can save and share, upload it to uh, the Adobe Revel account, share it on Facebook, or save it to the device. Now again, it's a very basic, bare-bones editor. I kind of hoped it had would have more to it. Hopefully Adobe will take it and build upon the foundation, add features like raw support, image resizing, um, text input, just a, little, a few more little bells and whistles to give Photoshop Express a little bit more punch to it. As is, it's okay. Could be a lot better. Luckily, it's a free app for your Windows 8 and Windows 8 RT device, so it's not going to cost you anything to give it a try. We'll have links to the Windows Store in the review. Thanks for watching.